channel reviews by Jamie so today I'm so excited because I'm doing a recipe for you guys today and it's actually a recipe for turkey burgers that my mom gave to me and she used to make it all the time back when I was living at home and then I asked for it specifically because it's so good so I make it for me and my husband now and we just love it and actually my mom was like yeah I'm making turkey burgers for dinner tonight and I'm like oh so am I definitely a favorite and I love it so much because it is so easy it uses such a small amount of ingredients so you don't need that much it's not like an intense recipe or anything because I'm not like this gourmet chef like I just like to cook simple things and then the other part of it that I love is that it seems pretty healthy to me I know there's all kinds of criteria for healthy but I think it's healthy it's made out of ground turkey which is very lean and you know there's a vegetable in it there's an onion so as part of my new like healthy lifestyle well, healthier lifestyle and did I just spit and just trying to lose weight I've also been really wanting to help like motivate other people because I know how hard it is to get motivated and I thought maybe I should collab with somebody just to get some extra motivation for people so there's a guy named Sanders and I watch him on YouTube a lot and I found him because we both reviewed the same item the Trish perfume even though we had different opinions on it you know you can still be friends you can still you know you ha can have different opinions I've been watching his videos since then and I find him so funny and I just really like his personality and I noticed that he put up a video about wanting to lose weight and just get healthier too and I thought this is a really good time for us to kind of spread the motivation around I guess just I just feel like it's easier when other people are doing it and just like the more people that can get involved the better oh so I'm gonna first show you my recipe using ground turkey and then at the end of my video you can take a look at his healthy recipe using ground turkey I think he's going to be making a turkey chili so um ooh, that sounds good so just kind of a fun thing that you can get two ideas how to use ground turkey which is a great way to cook when you're trying to stay healthy and fit oh i brought the ingredients here which is a little weird like they're sitting near makeup and stuff all you need is olive oil extra virgin i bought a brand new bottle in case you're like that's not enough Colby Jack cheese or any other shredded cheese. I like the Colby Jack. I think it works good in it. Chili powder. It provides the best taste. You're gonna go nuts over it. A medium-sized red onion. Sometimes I buy them already cut up because my eyes can't handle cutting it. But I decided to go for a fresh one. And at first I thought I got a pomegranate by accident. And I was like, no. And then the last but very important thing you'll need is a pound of ground turkey. So, um, this is kind of gross that I'm holding this up right now. I'm going to go ahead and show you how I make these. And this is actually going to be my dinner. So after I'm done filming, I'm going to go enjoy these wonderful turkey burgers, probably with a salad because they go really well with that. I don't use a bun with mine or anything. But you can take like some crackers or a piece of bread or, you know, anything you want. I just don't, I just like eating it like it's a steak or something because I love the flavor so much. But, you know, you can eat it however you want. You can make a regular burger out of them. Go right ahead and do that if you want to. I'm telling you, they're so good. I'm not even like a big round turkey fan, but I am with these. So go ahead and chop your red onion. Um, it's about a medium sized onion. I probably do a little bit less just because I get bored of all the chopping. And then go ahead and put one teaspoon of chili powder in there. And then for the cheese, it's about a half a cup to one cup. It really adds a lot of moisture to the turkey burgers, but you can always do a little bit less if you don't want to have as much cheese. But then you just kind of stir it all together. The cheese adds a lot of salt, so I don't add any extra. And then as I'm stirring and looking, I decided to add a little bit more cheese just because I'm a big cheese person and I love when they're so moist and so good. They don't really taste cheesy when they're done. That's the incredible part about it. And I get scared. And then 
I start heating up some olive oil and while I'm doing that I just form these into patties and I like to make them pretty flat otherwise they are impossible to cook all the way through and they just kind of burn so try to make them a little bit on the smaller flatter side and then go ahead and put them on the oil once it starts kind of sizzling a little bit and I learned my lesson not to cook these on too high of a heat so you can kind of start it at medium or turn it even a little bit lower and then just kind of flip them once they look a little bit brown on one side and I use a meat thermometer to check the temperature because I'm super paranoid and I just check the temperature and that's how I know when they're totally done and cooked all the way through. And I literally check each one and sometimes more than once just in case you can never be too sure and then go ahead and put them on your plate and I like to add in the extra onions that may have fallen out also and then sprinkle with a little bit of chili powder and you are done and they're amazing they go great with a salad hey guys so this is another Friday piece video but this one really means a lot to me I wonder 